April 22, a word in season to the weary by Brother Bach Singh. Endued with power from on high, Luke chapter 24 verse 49. The Lord appeared to the disciples at the lake of Tiberias at Galilee, when they had gone fishing. The disciples had toiled all night and had caught nothing. Early in the morning the Lord Jesus Christ appeared to them and said, Children have ye any meat? They answered him no. And he said unto them, Cast the net on the right side of the ship, and ye shall find. They obeyed him immediately, and were not able to pull the net into the boat for the great number of fish. There were 153 large fishes and yet the net was not broken, John chapter 21 verse 11. By this miracle the Lord taught his servants the disciples, the secret of an abundantly fruitful ministry in his service. Many of us go on struggling hard in the Lord's work and yet see no fruit. We depend too much upon our own zeal and wisdom. But when we learn the secret of finding God's plan for our ordinary activities we find the Lord coming in and making our labors fruitful. By coming into the heavenly plan for our personal, family and church life, we get the power of resurrection. At the same time he taught his disciples that just as the fishes obeyed the Lord Jesus Christ when he commanded them to go into the net without struggling, we have to obey his command and do what he asks and give him what he demands from us. What an orderly manner these great fishes came into the net without any striving, because they had heard the voice of the Creator. Similarly, in his service we have to keep ourselves under his subjection, free from any spirit of striving or jealousy. When the disciples came to the shore they saw a fire, and fish upon it, and bread, John chapter 21 verse 9. Thereby the Lord showed them that as they obeyed him, he made every provision for all their needs. The same applies to us. Fire speaks of the love with which he prepared it to keep them warm. At the same time it speaks of the fullness of the Spirit which we enjoy in his service when we obey him fully. The fish speak of the souls who are saved through us, as we obey his commandments, and the bread speaks of the word of God upon which we have to feed daily to receive extra strength. Then the Lord questioned Peter, Simon, son of Jonas, lovest thou me more than these? Feed my lambs. Feed my sheep. John chapter 21 verses 15 and 16. This shows how our love can be real only when we learn to feed his lambs and his sheep and shepherd them. It is only by helping others in their need and in bearing the burdens of each other with joy and sacrifice that we bring satisfaction to the loving heart of the Lord Jesus Christ, our great Chief Shepherd.